Hello and welcome everyone to another tutorial and today I will be showing all the people that don't know how to install snapshots or any type of dot jar. So this is going to be a quick video since there's really not much to cover on this. It's pretty quick and simple. Now you want to head over to mojang.com and uh, right here um, you're going to see that Minecraft snapshot week 23, the latest snapshot, will be right here. You want to download. You want to go down to where the download options are, and here we have this client and the server. Uh, depends you if you want both. You can go ahead and download both, but we're just going to do the client today. Now you want to click on client um, and let it download. Um, there you go. Go to your uh, downloads, and it should be here. The Minecraft.jar. You want to uh, minimize that and drag it onto your desktop. Now the next thing you want to do. If we just do this real quick. Um, next thing you want to do is go to your um, app data. Go to your start, run, and then app data. This is different for Macs, uh, but uh, I'm sure you know how to get to your app data by now. Um, but uh, if you don't know, you can just go to your uh, Minecraft. Go to your Minecraft launcher, and you can go to options, and you can go to um, the location of your minecraft.jar or the, the bin and here it is um, I'm actually using magic launcher which is a really good um, software or a program that you could use to start up minecraft in a much more simpler way um, but if you're not using it you can go to your options and then right here games location and local disk if you click options and you go here it's there too um, just as simple um, but if you don't know what Magic Launcher is, you can go Google it and download it. But um, this tutorial is going to be on Magic Launcher and the normal vanilla launcher. So go Google Magic Launcher and go ahead and download it. Um, the download should be um, down here for Windows, Mac, or Linux. So you can, or Linux. You can use any of these. Uh, it depends on your operating system. So go ahead and download that and extract it to wherever you want to use it so I extracted mine to my desktop and here it is alright now uh, double click your magic launcher uh, or start it up and go to your um, app data and it's over here you should open it from your bin uh, you want to drag in your uh, minecraft.jar and rename this to um, name of the actual um, the actual what's it called um, <laughs> the actual snapshot so I named it 12w23 um, now if you're using magic launcher uh, we'll head to the uh, vanilla one in a little bit you want to go to setup and I'm gonna make a if you you don't need to make a new one but if you were to make a new one it would look like this I would name it 12w23 and you can press OK and it'll look something like this um, yours won't have all this mod um, if this first time you're using it you probably won't have all these mods here um, you want to look up here at minecraft.jar um, if you see right here you can go here and select now it'll send you to it'll open up a little window and you can select your bin and over here is all your dot jars. You remember that we, um, the name of your dot jar that we used earlier, that we renamed earlier, so it was 12w23. Now you want to go and select that, and you want to open it, and there you go. It is now selected, and it'll say here the version of the dot jar, and we can, you can start it up from there. You just make sure you select 12w23, and you can log in, and it'll work just like that. Um, but if